Hey what's up guys this is Mayank Malik back again with new video so today in this video we are going to see the AICP Nougat Room 4 RG7 2015 variant so in this video I am going to do a full detailed review of this room so yeah without any further delay let's get started So let's start this review with the lock screen. So this is the lock screen and the clock font is quite big. So let's go into it. So this is all the look of no cut and this is the I guess this is the CM or Lineage OS launcher. Okay. Then uh, here is the toggle panel. and uh, the grid size is different from the others room as you see here and we can customize it with this we get a tons of other toggles like screen recorder heads up pulse pie i don't know what this pie and uh, Habitant display magics compass expand desktop battery mode so let's see what it done so battery balanced performance done okay so and also we get a AICP extra I'll talk to talk on this later so this is the all app first of all AICP extra and audio FX browser browser is working fine and Wi-Fi is also working fine this is the calculator calendar camera camera is working fine okay so as you see here camera is perfectly working fine the shutter speed is also quite capturing speed is also quite good okay so let's go back and clock same stuff contact email we get two file manager one is the CM file manager okay so as you see here CM and the next is the normal Android file manager then gallery magics manager you get magics manager inbuilt in this so properly rooted installed magics tap to start install okay then phone phone is working fine let me show you so let's call one to one let's call it again it's not a issue I guess the speaker is not working guys as you see here without it it is working but the speaker is not working okay then this is a setting recorder and let's go into setting then screen protection and uh, bluetooth is working more so let's jump into the AICP extra and let me show you what we get in it. So first of all we get all the customization that we do with this room like heads up notification status bar you can edit 
whatever you want no notification drawer quick setting you can do a lot of things like on lock screen I don't want clock so I disable it and like see this what the hell it is automatically started so this is the boot animation so guys it is automatically started I don't do anything and yeah see this this is the full detail review so okay so as you see here Monday May the clock is just disabled and it is looking quite good okay then uh, we do more extra things so just check it out if you want and uh, this is running on nougat 7.1.2 latest one I guess and status bar buttons memory we get about 687 MB free so it is quite good you can enable navigation bar if you want apps normal apps gesture you can double tap to slip like this slip once again slip it is quite good then if you press this power key twice you can jump to the camera like this quite good you can trigger the button that is on screen buttons and this is the quick settings okay then uh, Yeah, that's all in the in this room I'll show you all the main main things that we get and all the bugs so thank you guys for watching this video if you really like this video thumbs up and subscribe my channel for more videos like this stay tuned with my Android take care bye bye I'll see you in the next one